Hi, I'm Niall Wilson. I like these sort of questions. I'm a men's artistic gymnast, very, very good at Call of Duty, and I'm an Olympic Games first-timer. About myself, I love sport. You know, I've, I've trained gymnastics since I was four years old my whole life. I'm from Leeds, so I live in Pudsey. It's all right, Pudsey, yeah? <laughs> Very Yorkshire. Just a normal, normal town, school, shops. I've got my parents and a younger sister, so there's just the four of us. I'd say we're very, very close. Hobbies, you know, as I say, I love sport. I love to play golf, I love to play snooker. I like video editing, so doing stuff like this. I've got my own YouTube channel and blogging and things like that. In the life episode four, I'm absolutely loving making this series, guys. Happy guy. <laughs> I've just become a European champion on the, on the high bar, which is absolutely incredible. It's a very, very big stepping stone in, in my career. I train at Leeds Gymnastics Club. The guys we train, you know, we've we've grew up together, we've trained together, and I was putting out videos online of us, you know, doing some funky skill or some fun challenge. It keeps us entertained. Yeah, I'm very, very good at Call of Duty. Um, very strangely. I think it's a gymnast trait, you know, we try and master so many skills and repeat and repeat and repeat until we're awesome at it. A normal Saturday night, a weekend night, when I've got competitions coming up, I'll, uh, I like to see my friends relax, maybe go to the cinema. If I do have a break from competitions, I do like to go out um, with my mates. That should be a normal 20-year-old lad. So, BBC have sent me a challenge to name five must-have items that are going to Rio with me in my um, my suitcase. Number one, my gym bag. <laughs> I won't be able to do gymnastics without uh, all the equipment I need. Number two, I think it would have to be my inhaler. So I actually have asthma. So if I didn't take my inhaler, I would certainly be struggling also with my performance because I won't be able to breathe very well. Number three, I couldn't go without my phone. I need to get some good photos of uh, Rio. Number four, if baggage allowance was no issue, I would take my bed because it's very, very comfortable and sleep's very important. Number five, I would take my incredible smelling aftershave. You've got to smell good, haven't you? Uh, you don't want to be uh, stinking, you know, when you're, when you're competing for your country. I'm so excited and I think it's difficult to know what to expect. You're around thousands of athletes who are uh, with a common goal, you know, you don't even have to be gymnastics, you know, making lots of friends, getting to know other athletes, kind of on the same journey as you, you have a lot in common. Um, so that's always awesome, meeting new people. My goal is to go there and perform to my maximum potential. Who knows what can happen in the Olympic Games. I certainly have the capability of producing medals, I believe. The team is the most important thing, and for me to go there and do my job for my team and my country, a team medal would be the complete ultimate. That's my first time as video done. I really enjoyed it and I hope you you know got a good insight to what to what my life is like and fingers crossed I will see you in the Olympic Games.